Hey guys, girls, everyone, how you doing? Um, just wanted to let you know we've got a new project car. So, uh, what you got is nice 1975 Mini Clubman. Okay. Um, okay, it's got the little chrome caps on the wheels, which I've taken off. I just wanted to start polishing them. Uh, the car goes. It's in really good condition. Well, for its age at least. Uh, considering the fact that I'm the same age as this car. And this is in much better condition than I am. So, I uh, <laughs> can't complain there. Um, so, this is a project board me and the boys are going to do. Um, we are going to fix this car up there. It's quite a bit of work. I know it, does, it looks pretty cool. And, um, and I've done a, a bit of work already. I've cleaned the engine. Um, if you could see, I'm, like, I'm testing the colors. See, I've polished this little bit up here to see what the difference is. You can check how faded it was. A lot of pit in here. Uh, if you look on the roof, you get a lot of paint that's put in up. What happened was, I was behind a truck with bricks, damaged the roof, damaged the bonnet. Um, so that all needs fixing. And then uh, the bonnet, the roof was resprayed, but uh, you know, it's got little bits and pieces here and there that, that well, things could need a full respray to start off with. But uh, I'll polish the handle, look how nice that looks, yeah. But everything else, it functions, it goes, it's perfect, there's no problems. Uh, this cover for the dashboard fell off, so um, I just put that back in place, and if you look here, you'll see, like, this whole plate's loose, yeah. But, uh, you know, all in all, the thing is in really good condition, it's got the original leather seats, which I haven't taken these covers off yet. So we'll see what happens when we take the covers off. It's got the, still got the original uh, leather trimming. Uh, little things like, you know, it's got the original uh, handle, plastic handle here, but there they put a metal one on. So I need to just fix and clean things up. Dashboard needs to be redone. Uh, let's have a look at the engine. Let me show you the engine. Let's pop this hood open quickly. Okay, now the engine was in a really, really sorry state, um, it was black, sorry, I'm just trying to hook this thing in here, there, okay, the engine, original engine, 1.1, um, all these parts here, this was black, this was, it was oil that was gunked up, you couldn't even see this bracket here, that's how filthy the thing was, um, Lots of lots of degreaser, um, lots of cleaning agent, just to get the silver coming through. You can see a lot of parts are rusted; they need to be fixed and replaced. Um, you know, it's the guy that I got the car from. He was 91 years old. He uh, just he couldn't drive it anymore. His hip was giving in, so um, he couldn't climb in and out of the car, and it was a reluctant sell. But we were lucky; we got it. I mean, this, this bottom carrier, you can still see the, uh, some black bits there. I mean, that's how filthy it was. It was pitch black. I'm not joking. And it took about 10 different layers of degreaser to get that off. Um, but this is the engine. Still, it's, uh, it's cold. Okay. Haven't started. So we're going to do a cold start now quickly. And I can show you how the thing starts up. Let's put the key in here. Yeah. Okay, let's try, let's give it a try, okay, and that's without the choke, all this light's going off, ah, there we go, but I mean, that's yeah, that's a start with, without the choke at all, which is really good. The thing purrs and hums, sounds good, goes well. Um, what, what's happening is uh, I did, I do need to check, bleed the clutch. Uh, well, bleed the brakes, the clutch. The brakes feel like they're binding in places. Um, so everything it needs a proper overall. So this could be an awesome little project car for me and the boys. And uh, hopefully we. We'll be able to get this reliably on the road soon. 
needs a bit of a polish, give it a bit of a polish, make it look a little bit better. Got some new number plates to put on. Uh, the car's name's Kermit. So uh, I'm gonna have some number plates that have a little Kermit on them as well. Maybe do something Kermit related. Kermit the Frog. Uh, but it's, it's our next project, me and the boys. Long term project, so the updates are gonna be few and far between, but as I do stuff, I'll I'll put the video up, I'll try and uh, catalog everything and uh, yeah, have a, have a proper little diary. But uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Um, gotta go give it a little bit of a test for now just to check if uh, everything's okay since I've washed it. I don't want to make sure anything got wet. But uh, yeah, thanks for watching guys. We'll keep you updated how it goes. Cheers.